Hi everyone. So today we're going to be working on another set of coasters. I had so much fun doing the last set that I thought I would do another with you. Um, actually, I probably the rest of this week and maybe into a little bit of next week we'll be doing more coasters. Um, they are great for summer sales if you're doing art fairs. I know a lot of people um, are still doing some outside shows. Even with COVID, um, it's very limited though in certain areas of the country. But if you're lucky and you can get in and on a show, these are great sellers. So today we are using Amsterdam White that does have silicone, Praj Posse Chestnut Bronze, Praj Posse Gold Rush, and Praj Posse. Victorious Muscadine Wine. So that should be a pretty um, color combo. I'm going to do all four cups at one time this time so we don't have to take up a lot of time during the video. So we're going to go ahead and start with white. And I'm going to follow that with the chestnut bronze. And then we'll use the muscadine wine. It's a very pretty deep dark brick red, dark burgundy. It's just yummy. <laughs> and then we're gonna go with the gold rush. Now my in my head I'm saying oh black would look pretty, but since I already have white in, mm-mm. -mm. Don't want to do that. So I'll go ahead with some more white. Chestnut bronze. So if you haven't already, um, our jar paints are on sale. The last day of the sale is July 31st at 11.59 p.m. Um, I'm running different kinds of sales so that um, you can get jars. You can get 12, 16, or 28 jars. So if you want more information on that, just shoot me an email at christinawelchart at yahoo.com or if you're in our group, the Praj Posse on Facebook, all that information is there in the announcements and it's just for the jars we have um, quite a few colors over 30 that you can pick from you can pick more than one um, quantity in each color too I had one girl order six Carolina blues so if you have a favorite color you can order as many as you want so let's move those over Okay, I'm going to slide these two over and bring these down a little bit just so I can do one at a time. So I'm going to start with this one. Yummy goodness. I like to pinch my corners. Um, it does help cover the edge, and you do get your corner all that way. Because what you're doing is kind of doing a corner catch with your fingers. It's been super hot here on the coast. But we are getting work done. So it's not moving as fast as I normally do. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and leave this one. I'll torch them all at the end. I'll get this one here. And I'm going to go ahead and go right for it. 
So what you'll find though, you know, you can do the colors in the exact same order, flip them exactly the same, and you'll still have the same colors that coordinate with each other, but your designs will be totally different. That's the fun part about acrylic pouring. You just can't repli replicate um, a piece unless it's something that, you know, is color by color, layer by layer, you can get pretty close. We'll go over here. I'm going to go ahead and go right to that corner. Oops, sorry. Can't see, huh? These will be gorgeous when they are <clears throat> resin because of the metallics. You get to see these up closer when I torch. I'll do each one separate. Okay. See how different that is from that one, but it still has the same kind of design that this one has. I really enjoy making coasters. Uh, I like to give them as gifts and I sell them on Etsy. So if you're looking for some coasters, I have some beautiful sets on Etsy. But, um, you know, anytime you would have like a housewarming gift or a birthday gift or a co-worker. These make great gifts. Now I do resin these with heat resistant resin so you can put hot coffee cups on them. Alright, let me wipe my hands and we'll give them a torch. We're going to have a lot of red come up in that one, <laughs> hopefully. Okay, so I'm going to go this way. Here it comes. So, we have tons of cells. Let's let them rest for 10 minutes and I'll bring you back. Be right back. Okay, I'm back. Wow, I love these. So I'm going to move um, a couple out of the way so I can show you up close how pretty they are. Now I have to wipe my edges too. Let's <laughs> so get them out of the glare. They're just so pretty. I love that gold and that chestnut bronze with the Victoria's Muscadine wine. It just blends everything together. This is a pretty one too. I like to get that edge all cleaned off before I move them. I don't continue to drip. All that in the middle is gold, so it's going to be shiny and it has a lot of um, cells in there. It will continue to develop too and change a little bit. This one here has a little bit of everything and I'm in love with this corner. It's so pretty. And then, of course, we always get one, don't we, that doesn't quite blend, but it's like I was looking at it, how it would all piece together if I wanted to try to piece it together. It has some interesting bits, too, on this one over here. 
and all that bronze at the top. It's gorgeous though. Beautiful colors together. Oops, I touched it. We can fix that, no problem. But that's it guys. I'm in love with them. So um, if you haven't subscribed yet, please click below and ring that, click on that bell. You'll get notifications when I upload more videos. Click like, share, and leave a comment. Join us every Monday night. We're live at 9 p.m. right here on the channel. Um, I did start a Amazon wish list. If you want to send us um, some supplies, um, all you have to do is buy it on Amazon. They ship it to me. You don't have to worry about shipping it to us. Easy peasy. Some people requested. So, of course, we oblige. <laughs> Um, also, um, I'm going to be doing some blooming videos for coasters. I just want to, I have a bunch of coasters all cleaned and I want to get them used up because then when I resin, I like to do a ton of coasters. So you'll be seeing a lot of those. And um, I'm going to do a silent auction on my Facebook page, my Christina Welch Art Facebook page. Um, I'm going to list paintings on there probably sometime in August. And you'll be able to either buy them directly or um, you can put a bid in. I haven't decided yet how I'm going to do it. I can probably do a cap and say, you know, this is what I want for it. But here's the starting bid and see where we go from there. But it sounds like fun. Um, it's better than going online and doing a live auction. People are busy and kids are doing school from home. So I totally get it, guys. Totally get it. So... Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you all on the next one. Bye now.